Border Patrol was overwhelmed this past week with the arrival of spring, and Trump has to do something about it. Without a wall, border security is crumbling. As we reported Friday, the largest caravan yet is forming to take advantage of this weakness, and some are estimating it could grow to 20,000. And, according to AP, it's coming from El Salvador, Honduras, and Guatemala. Trump warned them to keep their people in their country back in December, but they haven't listened. So Trump is done with words. He's pulling the rug out from under them. From the hill. The United States will no longer provide foreign assistance to El Salvador, Guatemala, and Honduras. Wow. He finally did it. When he threatened this months ago, for a time the caravan seemed to slow down. But with this new wave coming, Trump made sure no one was confused why they're losing millions in aid. We were paying them tremendous amounts of money. And we're not paying them anymore. Because they haven't done a thing for us. They set up these caravans, he reportedly said. That's right. Why should we keep sending money to countries who are putting our nation at risk? Don't doubt for one second, America is by far the most generous country in the world. But we can't keep helping people if our borders are overrun and our economy is swamped. This has got to end, and Donald is ending it. He is pulling these funds, and he is also preparing to close down the border completely this week if Mexico doesn't start doing its part. The border is about to get very quiet, just the way it should be. Then the billions Trump just fought for and won are going to be spent building fences and walls to make our border secure again. But Democrats and the media are giving him plenty of heat over these decisions. It's exactly the opposite of what they would do. So he needs your support to get this done.